Hi YouTube friends and welcome to RK Treasure Center. My name is Roy and today's video is going to be what sold over the weekend. I did pull some items each day to make it a little bit easier for myself instead of just waiting until this one morning because I have a bunch of stuff going on. But I thought I'd go ahead and pull the items and tell you about what I paid for them and what they are and what they sold for. So let's go get those items. <music> First item is going to be over here in this bin. Let me move this stuff here out of the way. It's going to be right here. All right. And what this is, is a package of rosaries. I'll show a picture up to the side here. Um, I picked up this package of rosaries. I actually bought a bag of Lego block set and it was a big bolt bag so you couldn't really see what was in it but sometimes i'll find some good items in there or i can lot pieces together of the legos and sell them well this bag of rosaries was inside there it was 20 there was 10 green and 10 purple and so i picked them up lied it together basically it's a free item that came in that bag and these sold for 12 dollars plus the buyer paid the shipping all right the next item is also in that bin it's in here. It was right next to it. And it's a Eureka fragrance free eliminating vacuum filter. <laughs> Picked it up. Uh, just it was a dollar. So I couldn't pass it up, but I picked it up and it sold for five dollars and ninety nine cents plus the buyer paid the shipping. All right, so this item's going out. This is a Wilton cake pan. Let me turn it over so you can see it better. It is a 1998 Wilton. I don't know if you can see the number, but it's 21052034. This is a Wilton SUV cake pan. And it sold for $14 free shipping. I got this already wrapped up in a bag, but what this is, is a uh, power belt. It's a hydration belt for walkers and hikers. It contains two bottles, so that that way you can carry water and it goes around your waist. I'll show a picture of right next to it. And it sold for $10 plus the buyer paid the shipping. All right, the next item that I picked up was one that I picked up at an estate sale. Uh, I had got it uh, probably about three, four months ago. It's been listed and I was really happy to sell it. So let me grab it real quick. And it's this thing hidden way back here. And there's what it is. And I'll set it down right here so you can see it. And there's the, the designer. This is a J Largo statue. Um, it's a pioneer woman with her children and it's it was a really good find i was really happy to get that i picked it up like i said at that estate sale about it was in a video probably about three months ago paid up on it a little bit for me for an estate sale i pay, it's a bronze bronze statue you can hear it i paid twenty dollars it sold for seventy four dollars what did it sell for seventy four dollars and ninety five cents and the buyer paid the shipping all right this next item might take me a second to kind of get to it's down in here. It's in the plush items. I've had this one for a little while. Oh, it's right there. You have engaged my valuable service. <laughs> All right, let me get them over here. All right, this is a plush puss in boots. I picked them up, showed a video. I had my wife on the video when we did it. Um, he talks. He's animated, or not so much animated, but his voice uh, voice talks, and he makes different comments. We picked him up at a garage sale, I believe it was. I want to say we paid probably 50 cents for him. He sold for $9.95 and the buyer paid the shipping. So now's a good time in the video to say that if you like videos like this and you're not a subscriber, I want you to think about clicking over that subscribe button. But more than anything, I like to put out educational videos or videos like this that's going to show you. So if you like videos about garage sales and resales and flea markets and different things, then uh, biggest thing is give me a thumbs up, give me a like. It really helps and supports this channel if you like the video. 
Also leave a comment. I love comments. I like to be able to respond to them. I try to respond to every comment and sometimes I learn things. Also, if you want to follow me on Instagram, you can go to the top of the banner, click on the Instagram link, or you can go down to the link in the description below and click on Instagram. A lot of times I'll put out pictures and videos of things of what's going to come in these in these types of videos. So you'll already get a heads up. All right, the next item is sitting back here in the back inside this tub. And it's, and it's right. Oh, I'm making a big mess. Hopefully they don't break nothing. Let me set that down. I gotta be careful about what I'm doing back here. Otherwise I'm gonna break this. That's a really nice set right there. I don't wanna break those. Okay. So this is the next thing that's sold. Let me get it over here so you can see it. All right, this is the NFL, AFC, NFC uh, set of helmets. There's 32 helmets on both sides. I picked this up at a thrift store about a month ago. Um, it was a really good find. I think maybe I paid uh, $2, $3 for it, and it sold for $22.95, and the buyer paid the shipping. Hey, everyone. Well, it's the next day, and I've only got two items to pull today, so let's go get them. All right, so the first item for today is in here, somewhere down here, and it's right here. And it's in this package right here, which is a rock band microphone. I'll set it on the table so you can see. It's a rock band microphone. It's a USB plug-in, and it sold for $7.95, and the buyer paid the shipping. I picked it up at a thrift store just a few days ago and paid a dollar for it. The next item is up here, and I think it's this box here. Yes. No, it's not this box here. What is the next item? All right, the next item is back in here with all these breakable glasses. So let me move it around. All right, so this is the next item going out. It's a pair of Shrek and Donkey coffee mugs. I picked them up and sold. I picked them up and paid two dollars a piece for them, and sold them as a set for twenty-four dollars and ninety-five cents. And the buyer paid the shipping. All right, this is the last item that sold. It's another box of copper billiard chalk. So those are. Uh, quick little flips I sell. I don't make much money off of them. I've already made my money back on them. They're $6.75 free shipping. So I get it out after the shipping. I probably make about $1.50. Like I said, I've already made my money back. So I'm just trying to get rid of them now. All right. I try not to reuse boxes too much if I don't have to, but hey, you know, sometimes you got to save boxes or reuse them. You just do. So I got this box here and inside this package here that I wrapped in this envelope is the helmets and i thought i would go ahead this is the nfc afc helmets that i showed you and i thought i'd go ahead and show you a resizing real quick um, i put it down inside here now you can see i've already scored the box because i was going to do it before recording i thought let me go ahead and show it so many of you have seen resizers like this if you watch lonnie on garage flips uh he has these um he actually started selling them now uh, bearded picker has one a couple other people have one i've had this one for a little while uh, this one's just a box cutter and it also has the retractable wheel on the back for sizing boxes but sometimes you just need to be a little bit more exact um, you can come in here and you could take this put it out here and score it to the size you want and be pretty good with it this is what i had originally um, and a lot of times I still use it. Uh, it's real simple to use. You adjust it to the height you want it. So I put this box, in, this package in here. And uh, let me get my little ruler here. All right, so I put this package in here. Now I already know that I'm gonna need a little bit of room for padding. So I adjusted the size by about an inch and a half, maybe about an inch, depending on the padding you're gonna use. And I got this resizer and adjusted it 
and so I would set it right on the edge. If you had a nice crisp box and the edges were still up tight like this, you could do it. But I find it's easier to fold them down. It gives it a little bit more uh, thickness and support right through here. So all I do is just take this, put it down there, and it's kind of hard to do with one hand. But I just run it along the edge like this, back and forth, two times. And I'll do it like this, two times. And I do it all the way around. And once I've done that, I've created a score mark. So now you can take a exacto knife or any kind of blade or knife just go up the sides like that and basically you're going to that score mark it's a little hard to do with one hand i hope you can see it pretty good but basically you're just going to that where that score line is putting the blade through and just coming up put the blade through and come up all right and then so that way after i do get my padding i'll put my padding in a second but basically this is going to fold down like this now all right so it's just going to fold over right on top of that padding so you get the idea so anyway that's how you use a box to score that's how you use this kind of box score Handy little tool, and if I, I'll put the link to this in the description down below of where I get these from. All right, so there was my shipping cost today, $47.11. That's how much all the labels are going to cost. Confirm and pay. Print. And here they go. All right, so I'm gonna get these labels put on these packages and take them out to the post office. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget, check out the Instagram link. That way you can always see things that I post before they come out on videos. Also, uh, you can support the channel by clicking on any of the links down below. I'll have that box resizer down below if you wanna interest, if you're interested and wanna check out that box resizer. And I hope you enjoyed everything. So to all the resellers out there, remember, find it, sell it, profit. Y'all take care, everyone. Have a great day.